Hi, Dr. Beal. You look great. Thank you. When Pam, who suffers from a hereditary kidney disease, received a kidney from an anonymous donor in New York, it set in motion a revolutionary multiple transplant at UCLA, connecting families and transforming lives from coast to coast. In California, there's thousands of people that uh, need a kidney. They want to come free from the constraints of dialysis. Uh, and the problem is there's just not enough donors. Since Pam got a kidney from an anonymous living donor in New York, her cousin David, who had wanted to give her his kidney, was free to donate to someone else. The following day, David met the woman who received his kidney, Marcella, for the first time. Nice to meet you. Is feeling okay? Yes, happy. And excited. <laughs> And the story does not end here. Marcella's husband, Arturo, who had wanted to give his kidney to Marcella, but was not a match, gave his kidney instead to yet a third patient, Inoceta, who has struggled on dialysis for years. The following day, Inocenta and her family met Arturo. Yeah, yeah nice to meet you. Too. Thank you. Really good. Thank you. I think it's a great opportunity to, to show that, that you care for somebody because I see her on dialysis and it's, I mean, it's not a full, full life. Being part of this means that she gets her life back along with other people. Innocenta's daughter, who has watched her mother struggle, is overwhelmed by such a generous gift from a total stranger. Arturo? Thank you so much for what you've done for uh, my mom, I'm sorry. Uh, no, no, no. <laughs> no, this is good for all of us and you know, it makes me happy. So, and she'll be fine. I'm sorry. Oh no, this should be. You know, it's going to change people's lives. It's a revolution of sorts. And, you know, the people who otherwise would be lost without it are going to have new hope in their lives. Now with this chain, it's going to improve a lot of people's lives. And that's a wonderful thing. Well, it's a beautiful concept. I mean, uh, what happens is that you have a person who wants to donate a kidney out of the goodness of their heart. And that person gives a kidney to someone that has a donor that also wants to give to them, but they're not a match. So they get a kidney from a, uh, someone they don't know, but their donor that they do know gives a kidney to the next person. And it's a domino effect. It's kind of like the movie Pay It Forward. Kidney transplantation is life transforming. It's uh, very hard to have kidney failure and to be on a kidney machine. Uh, some people have described it as being half a life. Uh, and and, and uh, transplantation is the, is the clearly the best way to bring a life towards a near normal life. It's not totally normal, patients still have to take medications and still have to go to doctors, but, but all being well when things go well, which it usually does, uh, people can live very full and active lives, they be can become full people again. They got two possible loops that they might put me into. And the chain continues. Innocente's son, Randy, who had wanted to donate his kidney to his mom but was not a match, will now donate to the next person. And a donor in that family is expected to send a kidney back to New York. Well, I'm very excited about it. I mean, this is a groundbreaking program and it has potential to impact thousands of, of uh, patients' lives. I've done many transplants, but uh, for me this is really a revolution and uh, I wish I had thought of the idea myself because I think it's just such a simple idea. Why didn't we think of this sooner, you know? Um, and it's so elegant and so creative, but yet extremely powerful in its effect. Uh, and I see this as a huge move uh, in a positive direction for patients with kidney failure. This new thinking uh, permits us to um, uh, allow a donor to advance the health of their potential recipient without doing it directly. And that I think is a very, a very exciting. You help someone else and therefore you help, you help your loved one. And, uh, and that I think is a pretty marvelous thing.